clash of the promoted clubs coming into the match at the Moustoir in different mindsets. For host Lorient, it was a chance to try and recover the joy of their opening day win at home over Strasbourg after the disappointing defeat at Saint-Étienne a fortnight ago. Lons instead had less time to recover, but beating PSG on Thursday, even a weakened team by Covid, would have given them a major confidence boost, and they came out blazing. Florian Sotoka testing out Paul Nardi early on. And yet it was the host that took the lead on 14 minutes. Adrian Gerbic made his debut for Austria over the international break. And he may have had to have waited for a VAR check. But that confirmed his second goal since his 9 million euro arrival from Clermont. Well, clinical at one end. Daft at the other. Julien Laporte. Didn't look like he needed to make the challenge on Cortin Jean. The keeper had pushed out to block the striker. Instead, the defender cleaned him out. Gael Kakuta stood up and a fine strike to score his second penalty of the season already. Well, that was somewhat routine. Lon's next goal was anything but. A sumptuous overhead kick from Facunda Medina. A three and a half million euro signing from the Argentine Superliga. He'll be able to tell his kids about his first goal in France. Well, Lens hadn't won at Le Moustoir since a Coupe de la Ligue match 12 years ago when they'd scored three goals without reply. They're already looking very good at 2 1. Ignacio Ganago, the match winner against Paris Saint Germain, replacing Jean. And certainly, given the Cameroonian an extra bit of rest, paid off handsomely. Again, showing great strength and nimble feet and sliding it into the net. Consecutive goals in the top flight for the very first time. And then linked up brilliantly as they looked for a fourth. This time, Goalkeeper standing firm. A stunning effort from distance. Tested out Jean-Louis Leca. Canton Boagart would have been frustrated. Well, Lorient did finally get themselves back on the score sheet. Unfortunately, it went from bad to worse for Loic Badé. First, the penalty concession. Then the red card. And Johan Wissa. Scoring in successive home games for Lorient. But thankfully, for the defender, there wasn't enough time to deny Lons a 3-2 win. Two big wins in four days for the promoted side.